Hey guys, so today I'm going to do an unboxing of this sup. This one's called the Z-Ray X1 All-Round uh, SUP board. It's uh, quite a nice board. So uh, let's do the unboxing and you can see uh, what it comes with. So, I'll bring the camera closer so I'll show you what you get when it comes inside. So this one's brand new. <clears throat> okay. So this is what it looks like when you get it. So first thing you'll see is you get a nice leash. Uh, this is obviously for your ankle or your knee. Um, this board is quite cool because it comes with its own repair kit. So the repair kit obviously is quite cool. It's waterproof so you can take it with you when you're uh, busy supping. So that's great. Uh, then you've got your bag. Uh, the bags are apparently not great quality, but um, I've got one over here that's set up so you can see what it looks like. Um, so the bag is quite nice. It's, uh, it's a big bag. It's uh, got a lot of space, um, but a lot of people say that the zips break. So, um, yeah. But anyway, so that's the bag. Um, the bag comes with a couple of compartments. It's got this compartment on the side, uh, which you can see over here. And then there's another compartment on the other side, which is a clear one where uh, you can put the fin uh, or anything else you want to put in there. Okay, so uh, put the bag down and we'll get the actual sup out. Oh, wait a minute. Let's see. Uh, here's the fin uh, and an attachment. So this attachment is quite important because if you're going to um, be using a pump that's connected to your car, uh, then you can uh, use this one to pump it up actually. So um, I've got one of those, it's actually quite cool. You can check because sometimes an actual, if you've got a uh, Vauxhall, you might actually have one of these pumps in the in your boot. Uh, so this is quite cool. Uh, and then obviously your fin. The fin's got an attachment over here. So uh, you'll see that it actually attaches. All right, so that's the fin. Uh, we've got our paddles. So this sub has got, um, it's got two paddles that attach, so you can use this one for canoeing as well. So here's the two paddles actually, we can open this up and I can show you. So you can use this sub as a single board, uh, as, a, as a normal regular sub, or you can attach the other side to it and then it actually uses it as a canoe. So this, of course, is not a carbon fiber one that comes with it. But uh, one thing to make note of these is that they do sink. So make sure you attach some kind of flotation device to this. Um, just some kind of, uh, I don't know, you, you get those, uh, you know, if, you, if you're going to go supping, you'll wear like one of those vests. So you just attach some, some kind of uh, uh, device to that so it doesn't sink. Because if you do drop it, it will sink and it's gone. Okay, and now for the sup. Uh, the sup is pretty heavy, but it comes wrapped up with this device over here. Uh, this is just a strap to keep it all in. So uh, what I'll do is I'll actually open it up, and you can actually have a look at it. So this is what a brand new sup looks like. Um, so let's open it up, and you can have a look. So this is obviously the front, that's the back, it comes wrapped in plastic, we'll take that off, and here you go, so uh, we can actually show you the back here, so this is where you'll actually do the pumping, uh, so we'll bring the camera quickly a little bit closer and you can see that. So this is how we'll pump it up. So I'll actually pump it up so you can see how long it takes to pump up the sub. Uh, because the sub does come with its own pump. This actually looks really nice quality. Uh, this is like a rubber fabric. This is your grip for your feet. This is actually slightly elevated over here. So you can see the elevation on the back here. It's, it's really nice. It feels really good. Uh, this is obviously for your, uh, your ankle strap. Uh, so yeah, let's get this going. So it's quite a big sub. Uh, let's get the pump out. That's the last thing, last two things in the box. 
So, uh, last two things to unbox, uh, which is over here. So we've got the strap, which is for when you're wanting to go and canoe. So we'll attach that on. I'll make a video of how to attach that later. And then the last thing is your uh, pump. So you can see the pump. This is what it looks like. A lot of people say these pumps are not really that good. But uh, we'll test this one out and see how good it is. So let's open it up. And let's quickly pump this up. Okay, so how to attach it. It's quite, quite simple. So you'll see there is something on the side here which you'll attach this hose to and then the other side obviously goes into the sap itself so we'll have a look you just there's actually a release button over here if you press the button then all the air comes out uh, so what we'll do is we'll put this in and then you turn it until you can't turn anymore uh, the recommended pressure for this is 15 psi or 1.03 bars and you can see that actually over here so what we're going to do now is i'm going to actually pump it up and then i'll show you how quickly it takes to pump up so <clears throat> let's see how good this pump is not too bad, I think it'll take a couple of minutes. So we almost can see how it's inflated. Um, it's still not showing any pressure over here, but it's getting better. Okay, so let's have a look. You can see now this is already pretty hard. Um, if you can just stand a little bit back so we can look at it so you can see it's actually quite sturdy uh, let's quickly stand on it obviously it's still got quite a bit to go in terms of pumping but this is quite a nice board it's got the side from there to there is obviously 15 centimeters the build quality is actually really nice it feels really good and it's actually not too heavy either so let's check what PSI I'm on right now. Still got a way to go. So yeah, if you've got a couple of these that you're doing, it's definitely gonna work your arms out. But yeah, so let's quickly just unplug it over here. And then I'll quickly show you how the release valve works. So yeah, let's quickly just show you what the board looks underneath. So maybe you can go back a bit and have a look. Here you've got your fin and everything is quite stuck on here, looks quite nice, very sturdy. In terms of the weight, really light actually, very easy to carry. So there we go. Now to release, very simply you just press this button, so I'll quickly show you how quickly it releases, so we'll show you the whole board and release now and you just have to press the button once 
and then the air will just continue going. So you don't have to hold it in. And all the air, of course, comes out very easily. And that's when, of course, you're just going to fold it back and put it back in its bag. <coughs> so there you go, guys. That's the Z-Ray. And uh, so here you can see, just to wrap up, there is your pump. Uh, really nice pump. It's not too bad. A lot of people say it's not great, but it'll take you a good couple of minutes to actually pump this up up. And then the various attachments, which I've shown you already. So just to wrap up, you can see here, you've got your paddle, you've got your fin, and obviously your attachment here if you're going to be um, pumping it up with a machine which is obviously the preferable way to go. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoyed that. Let me know if you want another one. Thanks, bye.